For the first time since the 1990s, you can see a historic Harlem art collection. The paintings and sculptures show life in Harlem during the early 1900s. CBS 2's Ali Bauman has more. After 25 years stuck in a basement, artwork from the 20th century is being given new life once again. The Harlem Roots exhibit is back on display in its original home, the Adam Clayton Powell Jr. State Office Building, after repair and restoration work following a flood that damaged many of the pieces in storage. The art takes viewers back in time to the Harlem Renaissance, a time of intellectual, social, and artistic explosion. They are part of the evolving world here in New York City and in Harlem and really in the world. The collection of 24 paintings, photographs, prints and sculptures captures the essence of Harlem's rich culture, teaching about social issues and artistic techniques of the times, some of them ahead of their time. It's all about the hardship. It's all about the world that they lived in. This piece, titled African Series Phoenix, was painted by Harlan Jackson, a major pioneer of what later became known as abstract expressionism. Inspired by the people who lived, worked, struggled, and survived in the city, Lita Mitchell created this collage titled Street Jivin. Many of these artists helped to create what is now known as community art, some of America's finest works created in the 20th century by predominantly black and Latino artists in New York City. I hope that we have some budding artists come and see what their um, ancestry um, was able to accomplish. It just all tells the story about this community. And celebrates the neighborhood's rich and diverse culture. A total of more than 100 works of art will rotate in and out of the exhibit over the next year. Ali Bauman, CBS2 News. Starting November 15th, the free exhibition is open every Friday from noon to 7 p.m.